95% of the beauty gurus are me. Yeah, they are. What's good? What's poppin'? It's your boy Denzel Dina. Welcome back to my channel. Hello, how are you doing? Are you great? That's okay. So, um, I'm here with... Ricky Thompson. You know me. You know me. Stop playing these games. You know me. They don't know you, but Ricky is my neighbor, so I just decided to film a video with my neighbor. No, Ricky's my friend. We live in the same apartment complex, and... What? I'm your friend. Ricky is my friend. That's my... Ricky's my best friend. Okay. Okay, Ricky's my best friend. If you don't know, the receipt to be here, but you're about to go over it. So, um, like, last week I made a video about exposing roots and these, so I saw the video and I was like, the views are gonna pop, but now let's see if we can expose rude YouTubers. Not exposing rude YouTubers, but just telling you the YouTubers we met that were rude. Like, literally <laughs> so rude. So, um, I will say before I just say my last video, don't like throw any hate to these YouTubers. This is just what we experienced. And we experienced this like three years ago, 2014. We're in 2017. New life, new people. People change. Yeah. So. <laughs> like always, subscribe, 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 hit that bell to know what I post to get notified. As always, you already know the drill. So follow me on Twitter, turn on post notifications, follow me on Instagram, turn on my post notifications, and snap me, I snap back, the links will be down below. Okay, so go do that, and let me stop on Bram and let's get right on to this video. <laughs> so for the first ooh, YouTuber that was rude, is Miss Acacia Burley. Okay, so Acacia's nice now, mm -hmm. right? She's nice. She's nice. Yeah. I said that like I talked to her. I wouldn't talk to her for like three <laughs> seconds. Anyways, I guess she's nice now because she's pregnant. But um, Miss Acacia 2014 was mm -hmm. not so. Not a friendly woman. Not a friendly woman. You, 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 she was with you too? She's with me very, very good. Okay, yeah, but okay, so basically I told, I don't know from any, I don't know from Adam to Eve, like I don't know this girl. Because I, in 2014, like I was just a minor, I didn't know about YouTube, like I didn't know people actually made YouTube videos. So I was like, this girl's very pretty. I was like, oh, excuse me, I'm trying to tell you, like, you're so pretty, like, you're a bomb. She looked at me like, I'm like, ooh. Not an ugly. <laughs> so that was that with me. She was very rude to me. I was like, I was so taken back. That's why I said I would not be approaching people anymore. Yeah. How was she with you? Um, well, back in 2014, there was a thing called Digifest. Yes, it was lit. And um, basically, before Digifest, like, she found out I was going. And she was tweeting at me. She's like, oh my god, I want to meet you. Let's be friends. Like, okay, cool. We were DMing each other. Like, I thought me and her were very cool. So when I met her, I was like, oh my god, hey girl, like, what's up? And she was just like, mm -hmm. Like, she just acted like, well, why are you here? Like, why are you talking to me? And I was like, whoa, you DM'd me first. You followed me first. You tweeted at me first. So I don't understand why she was so rude, but yeah, that's how old girls acting. Bro, three years ago. Three years ago. But I mean, we did see her, what, 2016? We saw her 2016. Where we got? <laughs> <laughs> she looked right on us. So what did she do? She walked right on us. Right on. We like, ooh. She I'm saw so us too. She, she. <laughs> And she walked right on past. Like, we okay. saw her Coachella for like three weeks. I just said, hey. Yeah, she was nice. She, hey guys. And she was very cute. I mean, it's fine with Coachella. People want to be all bohemian. Yeah, and, she looks um, very beautiful too. Very, very beautiful. beautiful. She's such a pretty girl. Such the girl. next YouTuber, I should say, we're friends now, but when I first met her, she knows. Lauren Geraldo. If you guys know Lauren Geraldo, she goes by Princess Lauren. But no, Lauren Geraldo, okay, when I met this girl, was not cute. Um, I met her 2015 JG Fest in NYC. Okay, and there was this hotel called the Pop 39 that all of, like, all the town stayed at. And I'm on the elevator, this chick chat with my friends, the lolly guy, gang. And I see a hand reach up for my hair. Now, I was like, who is this girl? Who's this hand and why is it about to be put into my head? So she reached, to reach, to reach. <laughs> I don't know her, but I know I was probably very rough. But I said, she said, who the fuck are you? I said, I'm Denzel, bitch, who the fuck are you? Like, wow, it was a lot of crazy She was like, and then she was with Steven the Berries and someone else in the elevator. <laughs> and they were like, oh, that's Denzel. She was like, I don't know what he's doing. Like, like I said, don't touch my hair. You don't know, you can't touch my hair like that. I'm sorry. And then the next day, she was like, Oh, I'm so sorry for what happened yesterday. Very nice. He's like, I'm so sorry for what happened yesterday. I'm sorry that I touched your hair like that. Like, I knew it was really me, you know, I was crazy, whatever. I was like, yeah, it's fine. She's like, can I please still touch your hair? I was like, yeah, she touched my hair. It's just, I have, I've had that many encounters with a lot of people. If you see me, don't touch my hair. If you, like, I have, like, you might not believe it, I have fast reflexes, okay? I, I'm from a dangerous place. I'm like, like, <laughs> no, but I just, you know, it's just something like, don't touch my hair. 
it by don't don't touch my hair. Like ask before you touch. So do you have someone? Um, I have had a rude encounter with Miss Bethany Moda. I know, very shocking, like an angel, I know. She's nice to me now, she's nice to me now, but when I first met her at VidCon, she was very rude. She was just like, I guess she was just having like a bad day or whatever, but she just didn't care like to meet me. Like, I'm not trying to sound like I have, you know, like I'm up there or whatever. Bitch, because you're very I know, it's just not the best motive, but I was just like, oh my god, like, hello, hi. I'm like, okay. This is, this is the thing. You see how it was like, she's rude to you, but when I met Bethany, she was so nice to me. See, I don't When I met Bethany, Bethany Moda, I, it really did make me stay online, I'm not gonna lie. Because um, I went to some party, and I don't know YouTubers, because like I said, like, I didn't watch YouTube, but I just knew Bethany, because I lived in New York City, and um, when I go to the train station, who I see? Bethany Moda. <laughs> Bitch, I go outside, who would I see in front of, you know, Ariel Posto, Pasta, whatever. But you notice, know, I'm like, I know this girl, like, I know this girl. So, um, I'm like, hey, can I just, like, I was so scared, like, you know, I did put your product aside and just ask this, ask this girl picture. Yeah, yeah, right. So, um, I was like, oh my god, can I get a picture? She, like, she was eating, like, chips and guac. She's like, no way, you're dead down. I said, yes, I am! Yes, I am! <laughs> she was like, oh my god, you see the picture? She, she asked me for a picture. I was like, oh my god, that's And I told myself, I said, that's a bitch, you made it. I was so happy. <laughs> okay, now the next name. Miss Monica Church. Now, if you guys don't know Monica Church, I don't know how to describe her. I've never seen her videos, but I know she's a YouTuber because I always see her like at YouTube events. Miss Monica Church, I thought we were cool. We met, like, I, I think she, I, I remember with Ricky. She likes me. Her and her sister love me. We're sure. cool. I didn't know she had a sister. <laughs> but, um, basically, I thought we were cool. Like, I think I met when you and, you know, the friends that I used to have. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, I met, I met her through there, and I thought we were cool. Like, she seen me, she said hi. But me, Vanessa, Simply Nessa 15, her screen, if you don't know her name, Simply Nessa 15, and Ricky had to be. And we were all like, it's like, I was here, Ricky was here, Vanessa was like, let's say Vanessa was right next to Ricky, and we were all like tweeting each other, like, memes, like, oh, you're bald. And, we were like, laughing. We were laughing. Like, it was show. so funny because people like actually thought it was serious, and then some of the smart people knew, like, we were fucking around. So, but basically, Monica Church decided to DM her because Vanessa said something about my teeth. She was like, that's why your teeth are yellow, and you do shoot like yellow crayons and stuff like that. Monica Church decided to DM Vanessa like, yeah, good, Denzel need to clean her teeth. Oh, well, like, I know, girl, right? Good thing you came for him. Little to this Monica Church, no, Miss Monica Satan, no, that it was all fun and games. And I, if I, if Vanessa would show me the screenshot, I wish Vanessa could show me the screenshot, I'll put it right here. But yeah, and then I saw it like two weeks ago. And no words were shared between you two. <laughs> you gave her a look, she gave you a look. She her face. <laughs> you think Yoni said that's right, Monica Church? <laughs> that's right, Monica Church. <laughs> Somebody who's nice I met was uh, Gigi Gorgeous. Very, very gorgeous, by the way. She is so sweet. Like, I honestly thought she was gonna be a very stuck up person because, like, you know, the bitch is popping. So I was just very afraid. I was, like, very new in the game. And she was just very sweet to me. She's like, oh my God, how are you? I was like, you smell amazing. She's like, thank you. It's money. It's, it's money. That, that's a set of money right there. So it's, like, my first VidCon, too. So I was, like, very excited. So, yeah, she's a very sweet girl. Like, I love her. Gigi, yes, yes. Exactly. Okay, I said someone I met that's nice, but actually, like, a mind returns to me too much. Liza Koshi is so nice. So nice. Liza, I say her phone name, because some people like Liza, like, girl, not Liza, but Liza. <laughs> Liza is so nice, so, so humble, the nicest person ever meet. So nice. What you see online is what you really get in person. Yeah. She's actually so funny. So, yeah, now let's go back to the rude people, okay? Who else is rude? Okay, so this is a girl that is rude to both of us. You might know her. Miss Natalie Paris Eiffel Tower? Miss Ooh. Natalie Paris. <laughs> Ooh. Mm. Okay, well, basically this girl, um, I mean, we see her, but we used to see her around. We don't see her around anymore. But she's a YouTuber, and you know, she's like 16, 17, or whatever. But basically, this is how she's doing. So, I thought we were cool because she's friends with one of our friends, so I thought she always invite us or invite her to parties. But one time, she, there was a party in the O, are we going? And our friend was like, now you said that I can go, but you guys can't go because you're extra. Extra how? <laughs> how am how are we 
country. We are never extra. We are we never. We've never said any, not one word to you. We never but we said only come to you and say, like, hey, how are you? Yeah. Like, hey, how are you? Yeah, yeah. we want to get technical, talk about extra. Yeah. But I won't get into details. But you know, she's very, she's a very good girl. Every time I have a conversation with someone, she would come and interrupt. <laughs> and that shit's not cute. It's just not cute, and then she bumped us at Lucy Bellows. Yeah, she did. Excuse me, excuse me. VIP, VIP, VIP. I was like, girl, you in the same section we were at. And the thing is that you're not even in VIP to begin with. It's the girl you actually wear that's a VIP. Yeah. So it's like, girl. What the fuck on here, really? She knows, she, she knows our relationship, because when she sees us, she doesn't say a word. Mm -hmm. She said we're last time, but what did she get? Nothing. Denzel literally stared at her in her face. And I had to say, I had to say hello because the situation was so awkward. I was like, oh, hello. Like, that was it. You are so, so bad. I don't care. I'm, I'm so sorry. Bad. I'm not the type of person that can hide my emotions. But I'm thinking in my head. But how would you feel like this? you like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't talk shit about somebody and go say hello. If I talk shit about you, that means I don't like you. So why, why would I ever talk to you? She said, hello. Now, the next person that we met is actually so nice is Rice Gum. Rice Gum. I thought he was going to be an ass. I really did. I really did. I thought it was. I thought he was gonna be an ass, and I don't even really think about it like it makes sense. Like, why would he act like that kind of person? Yeah. I like, think who would act like that person? person? He was in a party that all the people he roasted was at the party. Mm -hmm. You know you gotta put the best thing on. Yeah. But as, you can just tell he's so nice as a person. He's so nice. He's so he's soft. So nice. He's actually so nice. And another person that we met us actually so nice is Trisha Paytas. Such a nice one. I don't know, but her videos is not what you get in person. Like, you don't see a sad girl. She's very, when I saw her, I knew it was her. I, I don't know, I wasn't a fan boy, but I just love, I just love, I'm not a fan of people, I'm just a fan of their lifestyle. <laughs> yeah. When I, I love luxury. I love luxury. <laughs> I love luxury. I don't know if I sound like a gold digger. I don't know when I sound, I love luxury. Like, even when I saw Kylie, I said, wow, the bag, bitch, the rest. <laughs> The rings. <laughs> I just love luxury. So when I saw Trisha Paytas, I didn't. Okay, I just heard she had a pink G bag. And me and Ricky are pulling off the phone um, at the grove. He's driving, and I see pink G bag. I said, "Bitch, Ricky, that's Trisha Paytas." We have to stop. Ricky's okay. Yes, I'm like, "Ricky, come here, come here." So we're in the car, and we see Trisha. I'm like, "Hey, girl." She goes, "Hey, girl." I'm like, "Wow." Oh shit, Trisha, I see you. She's still here, girl. Yeah, she lives here. That's my bitch, Trisha. Hurry up, so I can see her. Denzel, I can't get my ticket in. If you don't and you let my bitch run away, and you let her okay, run go. away, let's go. Hey, Trisha. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Wait, is it down? Yeah, just beep it, just beep it. Hey, Trisha. Hey, Trisha. Hey, Trisha, hey, girl. Hey, girl. Wait, just stop right there, bitch. We have to stop right here. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, we have to stop right here. Hey, girl. 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 Uh, who else is nice? Um, mm, oh my god. Oh my god. Just a, just all of them in a group are just so nice. I thought they'd be rude. I, I, I like you can like connect this too. When I met Marcus Butler, <laughs> Alfie, so uh, so nice. Uh, so nice. 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 I'm like, wow, y'all so nice. It was, um, and Louise, do you remember Louise? You remember Louise? Like, he never got to you too, but I met Louise. I will say some people, but I'm just gonna put them in a specific group. 95% mm -hmm. of the beauty gurus are me. Yeah, they are. I'm not gonna name any names, but. They have some attitudes. They have some attitudes. Some attitudes. Some attitudes. Some attitudes. I feel like everybody has had like a bad encounter with a beauty with guru. With a beauty guru, you've had to have yeah. a bad encounter with a beauty guru. Because beauty gurus just always act like they're they're not shit. Bad. They really do act like. I mean, hey, you make your coins. I will give you that. So what? Uh, you make coins? Yeah, to be honest. That is true, but I still understand why they gotta be so damn rude. Beauty gurus act like they're on top of the world. Yeah. They really do make their job sound like our job is like nothing. Nothing. Like, no I, we gotta make you laugh. Like, you just gotta put on makeup. <laughs> Like, I can't do that too right now, but still, you know what I mean? But I mean, there's so many nice beauty gurus, but there are some beauty gurus that are some, wow, some witches. Mm -hmm. Some witches. Okay, so another group YouTuber that Ricky has met is... Is Tana Monaco. Like, okay, when I first met Tana, I loved her. Like, so cool and everything like that. But then, like, I invited her over to my apartment for, like, a little nice little pregame. You know, when we're grown adults, you know, like, whatever. So I invited her over to my place for a little pregame or whatever. And um, she just came in, we were talking, loved her. I was like, okay, she's cool, whatever. 
And then she's like, oh, we're drinking this type of alcohol. Okay. I was like, oh, okay, what's wrong with that? She's like, you know, we need some more bougie stuff. Like, you got some else? They said raw. You guys raw? I was like, girl. I was like, girl, I got this. Like, it's fine. Like, uh, okay, whatever. So then I was just so taken back. I was like, okay, first, you want to mess around and call me cheap because I didn't get you a Ciroc, but it's whatever. Then um, I pulled out the paper cups and the girl was like, oh, um, we're drinking out of paper cups. I was like, girl, girl, <laughs> girl, first of all, I, if I have guests over, you're going to drink out of a paper cup, I'm sorry, because I'm not going to wash your dishes for you. And I hate washing my own dishes. So, yeah, why well, wash my nails? So I was like, no. And I have a, a lot of people over, so I wasn't going to like pull out, like, I have shot glasses. I'm not a broke ass bitch. I have, I have the shit. Like, I have it. But I just didn't want to go there. I was like, you know, you can have a drink and throw it away. As simple as that. But I was very taken back that she came into my home acting like that. Like acting very bourgeois and act like, I was like, okay. Yeah, like I was like, okay, girl. But yeah, that was like the only problem I had with her, you know? Yeah. When I'm in town, she was so nice. She's still, well, I mean, I've never seen her recently, I think. But she's so nice. Yeah, she's a nice girl. Kind of nice. Like, like, I've never got a room. Vibe from her, but I will say one, it's not a food account, but I will say one time I went to a restaurant and I was like, oh, cute. You know how I always say cute. I was like, oh, cute. You got a water. That's cute. She was like, it's not like I'm a broke bitch. Like, I can't afford a drink. I just don't drink water. Like, I can literally buy all the drinks off the menu. And the meat, but that's like each other. Same. But she's so nice, though. Like, she's, I'm never, I'm like, she's nice. So she's nice to me, but yeah. Yeah. No. To my face, <laughs> I was like, damn. You, do you see broke? <laughs> yeah. I was like, I was like, I was like, do you see broke? Like, okay, whatever, girl, whatever. Even though Tana was a nice girl to me and rude to you, the recent things I do not agree with. The recent events that are occurring, I'm very against it. I'm very taken back. I'm very taken back. I'm offended. I, I'm, I'm offended. I mean, I, we should be offended. We should be. But I'm very offended. So yeah. I just don't agree with anybody who uses that word in that type of term. You know what I mean? It's just not cool. It's not okay. Like, yeah, it didn't change how I thought about her. So it changed, but you know, don't like it. T. That's it for this video, guys. Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And like I said, see me. I'm doing it. You watch, I post. You don't watch, I don't post. So watch. And until then, see you later, my darlings. Bye.